Jim Verplot, um, director of Emerging Markets for Cadillac. Um, Jim, it's been five years since uh, we were on the brink. I remember those dark days, and now uh, everybody's real estate values are worth a lot more in Detroit. It's very positive. The vibe is great here. We had a great new launch just now with the coop. Yep. And um, we, we consider that uh, uh, Heroes of Detroit is, is about people who marketed us back into uh, solvency. So, what would you say was one of the, the, the critical moments in your memory over the last five years that you felt that okay, we got this thing, we're turning it around? Well, you know what, I don't know if there's one critical moment at any one time, but I remember, um, it was, I think it was something Mark Roy said, and it was basically, you know, there's a lot of factors we can't control, but the one thing we can control is kind of putting our heads down, focusing on work, focusing on making great products for our customers, and, you know, if we do that, you know, things will kind of solve themselves, and, and that's really what happened. I mean, there was so much outside of, you know, everyday work control, you had to focus on you know, just on your work and focus on the customer and bring in great products to market. And, you know, that, it just had a snowball effect. And I think that's what we're seeing now across all the, you know, all the different brands here. Everybody's bringing great stuff to the market. So um, I think a lot of people did that, but that's one thing that's always stood out to me. Just awesome. keep your head down, work hard, and things will take care of itself. And that's what you can control. Yeah, that's what how you can it, control. How does it make you uh, feel about, you're helping your neighbors, you're helping the community, uh, city of Detroit, um, you know, come back and, and real estate values are worth more people who are landlocked here. Does that give you a, a sense of purpose to your job every day? You know, it, it does. Um, you know, there's a lot of pride in this area and, and, and pride that, you know, I, I think collectively what what people in Metro Detroit discovered, you know, as, as my opinion was, um, they kind of rekindled that love affair with the auto industry. I mean, I think for so long it might have been something that was taken for granted, but I think everybody realized, you know what? We can build great cars, we can build great trucks, and when we do that and the market's strong, you know, all of us benefit in the region. And I, I, I see that now, is whether you talk to a neighbor, whether you talk to friends, everybody seems more engaged in the industry than they were five, ten years ago. It kind of rekindled that flame that this is the Motor City and we can, you know, build as good of cars and trucks as anybody in the world. As the one percent market share increase indicates, yeah. Cadillac's really on the uprise. Jim Brooklaw, we consider you a hero of Detroit. Thank you so much. Thank you, appreciate it. Thanks.